Okay, let us go to the next technique. Fifth problem, the sum of the phi digit digit numbers numbers formed by taking all the digits all the digits all the digits 1 3 5 7 9 is first option 6 0 6 0 0 0 second one 6 0 0 0 0 third one 66 0 0 0 fourth one 66 6 6 6 0 0 okay let us see So, now we have to find out in this problem the sum of the 5 digit numbers formed by taking all the digits 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. So, let us have a one question here. How many 5 digit numbers can be formed taking all the digits 1, 2, 3, 5, 7, 9? So, that means you know 5 factorial, 5 factorial means 120 numbers will come, 5 digit numbers. Is it possible to add 120 numbers in the entrance examinations? Just think, that may not be possible unless we have the technique or we have to follow some shortcut method. Some Technique has to be applied while solving the problem in the examination. Yes, we have one shortcut is there. Okay, do you want to know that shortcut? Okay, let us try. Here write down hint. The sum of the, the sum of the n digit numbers formed by taking all the digits all the digits from n digits is equal to so, better you remember this shortcut is equal to n minus 1 factorial write down multiplied by sum of the digits, sum of the digits multiplied by now here number of ones you have to write as equivalent to the digits. That means 1, 1, 1, 1, 1 dash dash n times. So, this is the shortcut. You must remember this one. If you remember this easily, this problem can be solved. Now, see here, this answer is equal to we can write answer. Here, phi, phi minus 1, 4 factorial sum of the digits 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 into how many ones should be written? 5 ones. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. This is 24 you know. 
into 16, 21, 24, 25 into 1, 1, 1, 1. So, 24 into 25. What is 25 into 24? Let us try. 25 into 24, 100, this is 50, 600, okay. Now, 600 multiplied by 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. That means, 6, 6, 6, 6, 6. How many 6s? Sixes? 5 6s. Sixes. 2 zeros. Do you expect the answer? Yes. Of all the options, fourth one is the answer. So, instead of adding 120 numbers, simply by using this shortcut, within less than 30 seconds, we can solve this problem. Now, one more technique. Sixth one, the circumcenter, the circumcenter of the triangle the circumcenter of the triangle formed by the points formed by the points 8 comma 6 6 comma 8 and minus 6 comma h is first option 6 comma h second option 0 comma 0 third option 8 comma 6 fourth option minus 6 comma 8. Okay. So, let us discuss what is the original method for this problem. Suppose, if A, B, C are the vertices of the triangle A, B, C, generally we find the perpendicular bisector of B, C, perpendicular bisector of C, A, perpendicular bisector of A B, side A B is, we get three linear equations. Solve any two of them, you get point of intersection. That point of intersection of the perpendicular bisectors or we mean to say the point of concurrence of the perpendicular bisectors of a triangle is called circumcenter. Just think if you want to find out one equation, it takes much time. For other equation, it takes additional time. So, to avoid that one, first observe the given points, coordinates, vertices. Here, 8 square 64, am I correct? 36, 64, sorry, 8 square 64. 6 square 36, 64 plus 36 is 100. Here also same thing we will get it, 6 square 36 plus 64, 100. You check here, minus 6 square is also 36 plus 64, 100. So, that means, if you say this is x1, y1, this is x2, y2, this is x3, y3, x1 square plus y1 square x 2 square plus y 2 square, x 3 square plus y 3 square are same. So, that means indirectly these three points are equidistant from origin. The point which is equidistant from the uh, vertices is also circumcenter. So, that is why origin is the right answer. So, second one is the right answer.
Now I will give the hint for you. Don't worry. Hint. If x1 square plus y1 square is equal to x2 square plus y2 square x3 square plus y3 square then the circumcenter the circumcenter of triangle with vertices with vertices x1 comma y1 x2 comma y2 and x3 comma y3 is origin 0 comma 0. So, here you check it just 8 square plus 6 square 100, 6 square plus 8 square 100, minus 6 square plus 8 square 100. So, therefore, origin is the circumcent that is all very simple circumcent.